Castro Miles was named in police reports as Wiggins' girlfriend, reports CBS Nashville affiliate WTVF-TV. Wiggins was charged Tuesday with hitting a woman and stealing her car. That woman was identified in a police report as Castro Miles, the station says. State, federal and local authorities conducted a manhunt of the area where Baker was fatally shot. Baker responded to a call about a suspicious car Wednesday, then couldn't be contacted for some time. Tennessee Bureau of Investigation spokeswoman Susan Nyland said at a news conference, the deputy's car was tracked by GPS to a location two or three miles away, and his body was found in the vehicle. He has the option to do the right thing, Dixon County Sheriff Jeff Bledsoe said of Wiggins. People make mistakes and people do things that are terrible, and this is an evil deed that he has done. But now he can show people that there's still something left in him by turning himself in. Bledsoe also said Wiggins needs to be held accountable, and said he wants the maximum penalty the law will allow. The sheriff said Baker was one of the department's best, a supervisor who had worked his way up to sergeant on patrol during his 10-year stint with the office. He is survived by his wife and daughter. Bledsoe said his agency has lost a brother, and the community has lost a hero. Our hearts shattered with this, he said. Wiggins was identified as the suspect from surveillance video from the area, Nyland said. He was already wanted on charges that he assaulted a woman and stole her car, according to a report from the Kingston Springs Police Department. The report says a woman told police early Tuesday that Wiggins had slapped her in the face and pulled out some of her hair, then put a gun to her head and threatened to kill her if she called police. She said he then grabbed her keys and took her car without her permission. At the time of the report, the woman, 38, told police Wiggins was doing meth all night and smoking marijuana. She told police she planned to press charges, the report said.